Hey everybody, how you doing? It's JBiz once again with another video. Today, as you can see, I'm going to be opening up a whole bunch of Pokemon team-ups, Sun and Moon. And I got these from Dollar Tree, so they were about a buck a pack. And I bought a, too many. But we're going to open them up, see what we get. I haven't opened up a friggin' pack of Pokemon cards since, oh. Probably uh, Series 1, Series 2, maybe? So, let's see what we get. I'm just going to rip, 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 and rip. Um, oh, actually, I have different... I even go through this box, but they have different uh, wrapper covers, so to speak. So, I really don't know what to expect. If you guys already know what to expect, uh, let's just see what we get. All right? So, let's get to ripping. Man, this is... Uh, it's going to be pretty exciting for me because I haven't, like I said, I haven't opened a Pokemon card pack in, since forever. So I don't know what's going to be good or what's not. I, I, oh, the symbol's still the same on the bottom of the card. So we got Tentacool here. Pretty nice. Paris, Paris, Paris. Rapid Dash, stage one. Uh, I guess that little diamond means this might be a little rare on the bottom here. And I guess this is just some kind of promo card. Uh, anyway, if you play Pokemon Play, oh, there's no codes on here or anything. So, all right, whatever. We'll throw that to the side. Guess we'll keep Rapid Dash in a separate pile. And let's go on to the next. Let's go rippy, rippity, rip. Yeah, I mean, this definitely was a childhood thing for me. And... You know, after I found those other Pokemon cards in my attic, you know, I kind of decided to uh, start getting back into it. I mean, it was always pretty cool. And Electro Charger, pretty cool. But this is probably going to be a long video because I probably have about 90 packs. So maybe I'll break this into a, a two-parter. But let's just keep going. Let's see if we get anything cool. It looks like a lot of this art might be the uh, original art from it. Voltorb. Weedle. And Ammonite. So I think that Ammonite's supposed to be rare. I don't know what kind of hollows or anything that's supposed to be in these packs. Maybe we should take a look at this. Okay, so that tells you some of the GX cards and everything. You guys can always freeze the video and get back to that. Alright, so there's a Pokemon I really don't recognize. Thank you. Dual Blade. Okay, looks like some kind of a accessory type of thing. Yeah, so if you guys have any knowledge on any of these cards that I don't know, because just like this card says here, my knowledge is basic, just uh, let me know. Let me know in the, the comments. Oh, here we go. Looks like our... I'm guessing this must be... Uh, I see the star on the bottom, so this must be a very rare card. It's a hollow. I don't know if you could uh, recognize that, but... Uh, Tyranitar, so that's cool. So we'll put that in a... Love that off to the side here. And we have a Graveler. It's supposed to be a little bit rare. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. Put there, put there, put there. Good. Throw that wrapper away. Panda. Panda, panda, panda. Squirtle. I know it's a basic, but I just, I, I just, Squirtle's like one of my first hits that I ever had in the Dangerous Drill. So I'm going to put Squirtle right here. Like I said, I mean, it's a basic, but come on, you can't go wrong with one of the three OGs. Oh, I see a hollow poking through. This is like a full hollow card. Oh man, I remember Vulpix. I like these simple, the simple art on these too. It's really cool. Oh, it's a full hollow electro charger. So we got the... Normal Electro Charger, and then the full Hollow. Not bad. Energy card. Promo. 
So two two holographic type cards so far. So I guess you guys can just kind of get an idea of what to expect from these Dollar Tree Sun and Moon team up packs. Dratini. Lapras. That's a star in there. Oh, wow. So that's a... I guess that's a more of a super rare kind of thing almost. Cool. Hitmochan. That's some cool art. So Hitmochan there. And how many packs is that so far? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, I think. So this is pack number nine. Oh man, I need my Wheaties this morning. Hopefully something good is in here. Give me so much trouble. Get rid of the promo card. A little, little Vol baby. Another star. Behind energy card. Pack number ten. Tentacle. What's got here? Oh, a full hollow Mr. Mime. Is it a full hollow? Yeah, full hollow. That's pretty cool. It's pretty nice. I have them to the side. An energy card. So we are 10 packs in so far, and a lot of good stuff. So. Let's go to 11. Get rid of this thing. Voltorb. Oh, I used to love Voltorb. And another Squirtle. Dragoneer. Pretty cool. So, did we get Dra Dratini before? I feel like we got Dratini, Dratini hit before. Let's put that other hollow there. No, it was Lapras. Okay. Not bad, not bad at all. Yeah, so many packs. I, I, you know, I was, I did start trying to prep a little bit for these videos. I see people like to weigh the packs now and kind of figure out uh, if there's a hollow in there or not, and that's how they kind of figure out what to buy. But I'm, I think I bought probably that's probably the whole box almost that I bought. So hopefully I don't have to go through these packs that. Been pretty much weighed and searched. Charmander. Oh, you can't go wrong, Charmander. Another basic OG. Another. Is this. Do we have this already? Yeah. Another full hollow Tyranier. Not bad. You go with your brother here. And energy card again. Alright, so I don't play the card game per se. I never really played the card game because I'm just. I'm just a collector. And I just. I don't know. I just never really thought about it like so you know I don't know how useful a lot of these cards are star you obviously love that guy uh but you guys can let me know if anything is you know super playable or anything if you need it and I'm sure we can work something out and this supposed to, I guess this is a semi rare card there so so far we got uh four four hollows and I guess, uh, actually, there might be a difference between these two. Let's check it out. All right, so this one isn't a full hollow. I was incorrect about that because you can see the actual box with the character isn't hollow. Or is it this the half hollow and this is the full hollow because it's the rest of the card and not just the picture? Both pretty cool, though. Not bad. Pretty cool. Get to the next pack. Zarua. The Grimer Hollow. Pretty cool. Chemical Breath. Oh, Fairy Charm. <laughs> what did I get? Chem oh, the Chemical Breath was the Grimer. 
Got a little ahead of myself. So I'm making quite the mess, but we're not going to stop. In the words of Sean Combs, can't stop, won't stop. Weedle, man, how many of these did you catch in the game back in the day? I actually played the Game Boy game, I should say. Just to catch a ton of those. Charmelia, nice. So close to Charizard. So close. You've got to go here with the the love, the love pile. You know? You got the diamond on the bottom, so, you know, you're a little rare too, but for me, it's about the L O V E, the L U V. In other words, got another Voltorb, another Weedle here. Actually, that's a different Weedle picture. So let's explore this a bit. We got that Weedle. This Weedle. So, all right, so they just have different abilities. So we have one with the Reckless Charge and the other one with the Tangle Drag and the Bug Bite. Okay, all right. I didn't know they were doing that now. I thought it was uh, pretty much you get what you get. That's pretty cool. And, oh, let's just look at what else is in this pack. We have a uh, Gold Duck. That's a gorgeous card. That really is. And if you guys know anything about, like, grading, card grading, because I'm starting to get into that, too, and what do you guys use to grade your Pokemon cards? Which third-party uh, grading company? Because, like, that gold, gold Duck, you know, I don't think it's super rare or anything, but I just think it's just a beautiful card, and it'll look even more beautiful slabbed. Oh, look at that. That's some great art. That's some kind of super rare, it looks like, almost. I guess it's because of the art. So, I don't know. I'll put that in the rare pile. And Energy. Elephant Man. Energy God. Alright, so... I could probably rip these a little faster if I do it that way. So let's get rid of that. Cosmog. That's a cool name. Cool looking tyke there. Tangaro. Let's get rid of the energy quick. And oh, that's some kind of a rare too. It's actually that's it's a pretty tight looking uh, creature right there, right? You know, got his dukes up, ready to go. He went from that cute little thing to a full grown B -b beast. That, not bad at all. That's a cool looking bird. Another rare. Skarmory? Skarmory. Not bad at all. Up. Oh, I see something shining from within. Star you. Bad. I still love that thing. And we got a Tauros. Look at that. Look at that bling. It's nice art, too. Pretty cool. Some more energy. So I'll probably do another five or six packs. I don't know if you guys actually want to sit here and see all of them at once. Or maybe you do, because this way you'll know what to expect. Like I said, there's about 90 packs. I think it was 91. Charmander again. Charmander, is this the same? Nope, this is a different Charmander too. One with Ember, one with Scratch. So It's pretty cool. They got multiple versions of the same 
types of Pokemon. I think that's pretty cool. And let's just go through the rest of the pile. All right, so let's bring a little bit of organization to this. So these are all our hollows so far. Okie dokie. Keep trying to find a sweet spot for these cards. I don't ruin them. More Paris. Roll baby again. An unidentified fossil card. <clears throat> that actually looks like it would be pretty handy in a card game. Pidgey. Oh, you all, everybody had a Pidgey. Everyone had a Pidgey out there. And an Aerodactyl. Awesome. Hollow Aerodactyl. Oh, that's, a, that's, that's gorgeous. That's really nice. Far-fetched. That's really nice. You can have the spotlight now. Come into the stage, Aerodactyl. <laughs> so let's move along. Have the pack here. Rippity rippity rip. Honage. Need Doran. Hmm, that's pretty interesting, right? It's cute. And Tentacruel. Tentacruel. That's nice. A lot of color in that. Even though he's menacing, he has like the. He has like all the cute little underwater sea life, plant life around him. And not just one Nidoran, two Nidorans. Geodude, my man. Hollow Geodude. Looking like Gumby, clay style, claymation style. And another energy. So. So this is a 2019 product. And we all know what's going on now with the pandemic. So it's kind of hard to even find things to open. And I'm sure that I'm not the only one that's uh, noticing this, but it's a nice Needle Queen. Look at that anime style art on there. Yeah, so I'm, I'm sure an energy card. I'm sure that I'm not the only one that's noticed that. So I probably, on a normal basis... I would not pick up old 90s packs, but due to the circumstances, it's just nice to have something to rip in. I get to share it with you guys. So, wow, look at this. Latias and Latios GX. So, this is our first GX card. Holy smokes. This is beautiful. Really gorgeous. Man. And a dragon there. So, so I'm guessing these GX cards must be the cream of the crop for this set. So we got one. Uh, I don't know how many packs we took to get to it, but we got one. So you know what? I'm going to open one more pack because we're coming around the 20 minute mark. And then there will be a part due to follow. So last pack of the video. Larvitar. Meowth. Meow, that's right. And Farfetch. So, almost ended it with the bang for this video, but as you can see, that's the highlight. One GX card. And I will catch you guys for part two. So, hang tight. I'm going to try to post them not too far apart. And I will see you in the next try.